All right, guys, so I've taken apart this Made in China Nintendo USB device. And this is what we have inside. Pretty simple, just um, those screws and one screw for the board that basically hold, holds it in place. And what I'm having trouble with is the up and down. So what I'm gonna do is clean this with alcohol. You can see this board is from 2012, so it's probably has different revisions now. But I just wanted to show you um, how to clean this up. I'm gonna get some alcohol and clean all this up here, all these contacts, because basically those those pads right there are what makes contact with 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 this pad. So it's interesting enough. There's actually two different um, start and selects. I'm not sure why they did that, but um, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, and that should fix the issue. All right, let's rock. So the stuff I'm gonna be using is 91% isopropyl alcohol. You can buy these at Walmart, Equate, they're pretty cheap. And uh, I'm just gonna put a little bit on some Q-tip. And that's gonna be our cleansing agent. So let's begin with the board. I don't like how this board doesn't have the connection to hold this in the case, but I'm gonna rig something up, maybe with some hot glue, so it doesn't create stress. All right, so the problems I'm having is with the up and down, so I'm gonna work on that. Clean that up. You can already see there's dirt and grime right there. Ideally, it'd be nice if you have a little plate where you can pour the stuff into. These aren't having an issue, but I'm gonna clean them anyway. All right, that's done. I'm gonna pour some more into uh, the other side. And I'm gonna clean the uh, the contacts here. The actual, you see these black contacts, that's what helps make the connection, just in case. All right, we're done cleaning. And you can see what came off of that. Let's put it together and let's test it out. All right, so I just tested it out. Um, I wrapped the wires through this loop to create the tension. Uh, normally, you don't have that kind of a setup. You have something like, like this. And that locks this in place right in between those two, but this is a bad design, but regardless, um, we're gonna test this out. I'm gonna put this back together and let's uh, test it out. The app I'll be using is called Joystick Show for my Mac. And I'll show you how that, exactly how that works. All right, so here's the joystick. It looks pretty legit. Nintendo style. Remember the problem we're having is up and down. So this app here, unfortunately, is too small. Let me see if I can expand it. I guess, so this is called Joystick Show, and you get about, um, I think I think it's like 99 cents to buy it. It's not too expensive. You can see the one triggering there. Here's button two. Here's my start button. You can see it blinking in the background. Let me zoom in more. Here's my select. Let's try left and right. Left, right, that works. Up, down, oh yeah, and the up and down feels a lot more uh, smoother for sure. So that's more responsive. Awesome, so there we go, easy fix.